Welcome to Homebrewing TV. Today I'm going to be installing the Blickman Engineering boil coil into my 15 gallon kettle. Stick with me. Welcome back. The Blickman boil coil when shipped comes with the uh, heating coil, the power cord, the cover for the power cord to plug into, and some instructions. Uh, all the tools you're going to be needing are a number four step drill, an auto punch, a seven eighths inch deep socket, pair of scissors, um, and a drill of course. Step one is we need to measure out the back page. They have a template. So we're going to cut out that template and get it affixed to the front of the kettle. things I'm going to do is I'm just going to mark with a marker where those holes are so it's a little easier for me to find. And then on the step bit I'm going to find 5 eighths and I'm going to mark the one above it so that I don't accidentally go too deep. I'm going to drill in my pilot hole. What I'm going to do is I'm going to drill backwards just a little bit, just to get it seated. Take our step drill and we're gonna All right. All right, that was the hard part. We got the holes drilled. Now we are going to take Coil. Take off the two nuts. And we're going to place them inside. So that poke out the holes. So once those are out, we're going to take the cover plate. I'm going to stick that right over the top. you got them started. Okay. Wrench. And we're going to tighten those down. You 
don't want to over tighten it because you can damage these posts. And then uh, on the inside, you've got your coils coming in, your pickup tube. That's it. Fairly simple install. It'll take you anywhere from 10 to 20 minutes start to finish. Uh, you just want to make sure you really punch those uh, guide holes in really well. Um, and don't do what I did. Leave, leave their template on there the entire time. Uh, should something happen and you need to uh, put the template back on, it's really going to be really hard for you to get it lined up exactly the way you had it before. Um, so leave the template on there while you're drilling the holes. Um, this is all done. So at this point, uh, you just plug it into a power controller. Uh, do not plug this directly into a wall socket. You will burn that coil out almost instantly. Uh, I will be using the Blickman uh, Engineering Power Controller. It's a brand new controller they've got coming out. Uh, I will have a video on this soon. It's not complete yet. When it is done, I will put it up in the corner here and in the description below. Should you have any questions whatsoever about the install of the uh, boil coil, please put those in the comments below. I'd be happy to answer those for you. Until next time, keep growing, my friends. In addition to this channel, you can also find us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Thank you so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and share it with anyone who might enjoy it. If you're new to the channel, click the subscribe button and remember to also click the bell icon so that you can be notified when there's new content available.